Hi guys, so we are going to see the legend printing to see where all the components are placed. Okay, but nowadays uh, components are placed on the board by machine. Is still useful to print the legend? Well, you're right, less and less. But indeed, in case of reparation, later on it's better to have the place of the component. Here we will see the standard legend printing machine, but also the new jet printing processes. The circuit board is covered with solder mask, and we are now ready to enter a new phase by creating a legend text on the board. The legend printing process prints all of the vital information on the board, such as manufacturer marks, company ID numbers, and warning labels. This can help in identifying the board and also in marking component locations to aid in fault finding. As with most stages of PCB manufacturing, the artwork from the Gerber file is essential in the process of printing the legend pattern. The first method is screen printing, also known as silk screen process. Whether manual or automatic, they both require polyester screens stretched across aluminum frames. Both the aluminum frames and the panel are registered to guarantee proper alignment, to avoid print ink on the copper pattern, and to ensure that the soldering process will not be affected. The ink is pushed through the stencil onto the laminate. Once the PCB has been silk screened with the correct information, visual inspection is carried out by the operator. If the result of the screen printing is good, the boards will be cured to harden the ink. The second process of applying the legend text works like a conventional inkjet printer and is known as DLP, or direct legend printing. Registration is done automatically by the machine. The inkjet printer sprays ink droplets on the panel to generate the image. These ink droplets are directly cured by UV lights. Visual control is also carried out by the operator to make sure the legend is correctly printed. Despite more modern equipment, this efficient process is preferable only for prototyping and small volumes, while screen printing is much faster and used for mass production. So, Clément, now all the patterns are finished. Inner layer, outer layer, solder mask, legend printing, okay. everything is down. But the board needs to have protection. So the next step, we will have the surface finishing. Stay tuned!